Having a child is the best moment in any parent's life, but for one mother, it almost killed her. Yeah, she was on her deathbed just days after giving birth to her son, but two years later, that pain gave birth to a cause, and now she's raising awareness about a deadly condition few even know about to make our community a better land. Labor pains were grave. It was terrifying. Two years later, Marie McCausland <gasps> happily raises the future. It is my baby. Four days after giving birth to her son, Jeffrey, Marie lie on her deathbed. And when I went to lay down, I actually had this feeling, if I go to sleep, I won't wake up. <laughs> she had read up on all things pregnancy, including an article that mentioned preeclampsia. I had that in the back of my mind when my symptoms came up. The deadly condition brings swelling, blurred vision, and dangerously high blood pressure. My blood pressure actually peaked in the emergency room at 200 over 115. And still they, they, the ER doctor wanted to send me home. I had eye rolls from the nurses. She says medics transferred her from University Hospital in Parma to the main campus 10 hours later. And doctors there immediately diagnosed her with preeclampsia. I checked literally every box. Awful as it was, Marie says this isn't every mother's experience. I'm white. white. I'm white, okay? Like, <laughs> I nearly died. But black women are dying more, and they're dying more in this community. The Centers for Disease Control says preeclampsia happens in about 1 in 25 pregnancies in the United States. Researchers also say African-American women are three times more likely to die from it. No one knows why, but dismissal like Marie experienced doesn't help. I want to save women's lives. Here's how Mama. she pushes to be louder than a labor screen. They changed their protocols because of what happened to me. Marie says the whole staff at University Hospital retrained to recognize postpartum hypertension. And an OB has to see, physically see the patient within an hour. She came up with this symptoms checklist. She's giving her life to a cause. Saturday, Marie will participate in the Cleveland Promise Walk for preeclampsia, taking steps to raise awareness and survival rates. Very important issue yes, more we need to know about.